I have a surprise for you. Uh-huh. Just put a number into our system. You have, yeah. I want you to call that number. Don't look at It's not Emma Ratajkowski, by the way. Yeah, well, it's an Australian number, so... What the hell have you teed up now? Hello? <laughs> no way! It's aggro! <laughs> Why, Crammy, you lying bugger? <laughs> aggro! I can't believe it's aggro! As if I, did, as if I didn't reply to you. How dare you? I... Just because you won some Lego. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I wrote to you when I was like, I swear, seven or eight years old, and I, I mentioned this on the show the other day, and obviously this is why you, you've, mm-hmm. you've, you've teed this up. And, and I, I don't know whether it got lost in the mail, aggro, I don't know what happened, but I, I never got a response. How, how many letters were you getting back in the day, just to try and make me feel okay? Because I, I assume you were, like, swamped and bombarded with fan mail back in the day. Uh, 700 letters a week. Wow. Wow, that's incredible. I mean, especially to think of now. Cause people... And I tried to sell each of those children a show bag worth $8. <laughs> of course you did. Oh, so you... the agro show bag. So... 80 cents worth of do- uh, value for just 8 bucks. So clearly, <laughs> Grammy didn't include the 8 bucks in his letter when he sent to you his letter. Mm. No. <laughs> but I appreciate you uh, liking aggro back in the day, Crammy. Oh, mate, I mean, TV these days just isn't the same. I would give anything to have aggro's cutting connection back on the te- telly same. right now. Oh, it's so good. Love you, aggro. Oh, no, it's shocking. And, you know, but it's so bad now. It's so, what's the word, woke? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. Well, I mean, aggro, th- this is an absolute dream. Thanks so much for organising this. The null, that's a, You're welcome, a bloody, mate. bloody awesome surprise. <laughs> Um, I used to love aggro back in the day. I... You've talked about aggro so many times on this show. Yeah. I'm like, got to make this happen for you. <laughs> yeah, well, I can't believe it. I was just sitting at home and then I get this little message from Lindell and, you know, can we do it now? And he, he hasn't got a clue. And I said, cram in. And she said, yeah. And I said, he definitely doesn't have a clue. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you're still not getting $8 for a show bag, though, aggro, all right? <laughs> well, I, I'll look for your letter. <laughs> All right, I'll take I'll take that. Go through the archives. Yeah, yeah try and find it. Well, well, thanks so oh, much. Here it is, my darling Agro. <laughs> I can't wait for us to meet behind the grandstand <laughs> in Wollongong <laughs> at eight o'clock. Uh, yep. Yeah. I got it. Yeah, okay, cool. I'm glad you finally got it, mate. Thank you. Thank I'm surprised you so much. I had that many words and he's from Dapto. He can't spell very well. Oh, come on, mate. It's not that bad. Well, um, Lindell, thanks so much for organizing. Well, Crammy, me. you're lucky to have Lindell as a partner and no one else would have done this. Oh, well, I appreciate it, Lindell. Thank you so much. You're welcome, mate. All right. It's, it's not drink. Emily Ratajkowski, but it's a close second. Yeah, it is a very close second. Agro, yeah. yeah I love it. All right. Well, uh, <laughs> thanks for chatting to us, Agro. You're a legend. Pleasure. I'm happy to send the eight bucks and I'll send you a show bag. <laughs> You're not getting the bloody eight bucks. We'd love a show bag. I'll send it. I'll get Big Boss Barry onto it. Thanks, Agro. Bye. See ya.